I have heard several important studies in the United States and the United Kingdom that analyzed how long cats live, taking into account all the factors we will cover. The average age of a domestic cat seems to be around 15 years. Different studies come up with different results, but when they are taken together, on average, 15 years serve as a sensible reference. The good news is that domestic cats seem to be living longer. The study published in the Journal of Family Medicine and Surgery found that the average life expectancy of a cat is now around 15 years. Just a few decades ago, the average lifespan of a cat was in single digits. The study found that about 20% of cats were 11 years or older. Before I explain better, comment here what is your cat's age and see if his life expectancy is high. Experts believe that cats are living longer because medical advances are helping to prevent diseases in cats. This study was conducted in 2016, so it does not take into account medical advances for cats in the last six years. The study recognized the lack of research in this area, which means that nobody really knows how much they could live, but they could lead a healthy life. Currently, cats are considered geriatric at 15 years old. When considering how long cats live, it helps to take into account the classic phases in a cat's life, which are kitten, zero to six months, equivalent to a human baby, junior cat, from six months to two years, equivalent to human adolescence, adult, from three to six years, equivalent to a human between 20 and 30 years old, mature cat, from seven to 10 years, equivalent to a middle-aged human, for example, between 40 and 50 years old, senior cat, from 11 to 14 years, equivalent to a human between 60 and 70 years old, and geriatric cats, 15 years or older. So, here are some things you do that can shorten your cat's life expectancy. Number one, let them have access to the street. According to the SPC, even an indoor cat's life is from three to 17 years, and cats living up to 20 years are not uncommon. In general, outdoor cats, who can roam, have shorter lives than indoor cats because they are exposed to various dangers that indoor cats are not. These include traffic accidents, attacks from other animals, and certain diseases. It is estimated that the lifespan of an outdoor cat may be two to three years shorter than that of indoor cats. Number two, not getting regular checkups at the vet. Cats are capable of telling when they are not well, and they tend to keep their bad feelings to themselves. Often, when the owner notices that something is wrong, it may be too late to help the cat. Therefore, regular medical checkups with veterinarians are particularly important for cats. This is the best chance to find any problems early enough to allow for treatment and recovery. Number three, providing a poor diet. Like humans, diet is a critical factor in a cat's life. An ideal diet is rich in moisture and nutrient dense. Cats are also prone to dehydration, so having multiple drink options for your cat is a good idea. And avoid giving them human food, although some human foods are not toxic. A cat's digestive system is built around proteins and not designed for what we eat, which can end up causing problems for them when your cat encounters health issues. There are many different types of cat foods, specially formulated to help with their issues, whether it's for weight loss, gastrointestinal problems, and many other health issues. Additionally, as your cat ages, cat food formulations designed to support the elderly and their common health issues. Weight is also a problem when it comes to health. On average, a cat's lifespan is reduced by six months for every one kilo increase in adult body weight. Number four, lack of exercise. Once again, some of these factors sound familiar to humans. The more your cat moves, the more likely they are to stay in good health. If you have an interactive cat toy, these are ideal for making your cat hunt. Two, cats can also be great for indoor cats as they allow them to jump and stretch. Number five, lack of enrichment. Cats can also become depressed, particularly those who are bored. Most cats enjoy some variety in their lives and are more effective when engaged in their hunting instinct. Again, toys and climbing equipment can help keep your cat entertained but the best way to keep your cat in the best mental spirits is to spend quality time playing with him or her yourself. Number six, not spaying her. Spaying removes the risk of developing diseases that can affect a cat's reproductive system. 
Additionally, female cats should live one to two years longer than male cats. So, what's the difference between a sick cat and an old cat? As your cat ages, it experiences changes in behavior, appearance, and physical health. Cats should maintain their ability to play and jump as they age, even if it's reduced. Cats should also be able to maintain a healthy weight as they age. There shouldn't be significant changes in muscle mass or body fat. Behaviorally, your cat's sleep patterns may change, its meows and other vocalizations may change, and they may become less tolerant in terms of appearance. Their nails may thicken, pupils may become cloudy, and teeth may become slightly yellow due to thickening of the walls. Additionally, there may be changes in your cat's daily routine, a decline in vision and mobility, and in its sense of smell and hearing. A good way to keep an eye on your older cat's health is to watch for signs of cognitive decline, such as disorientation, loss of familiar areas, or failure to recognize family members, changes in interaction, they may become more clingy or irritable, sleep disturbances, changes in sleep patterns, soiling the house, i.e., going to the bathroom in places they didn't before, and changes in activity, i.e., showing less interest in playing or excessive grooming. As a matter of interest, here are the leading causes of death in cats. Trauma at 12.2%, kidney disease at 12.1%, cancer at 10.8%, brain disease at 7%, lung disease at 5.5%, and cardiovascular disease at 4.2%. So how do you increase your cat's life expectancy? The way to help sustain a longer life for your favorite feline the first step is to keep an eye on it and be mindful of changes. You know your kitty better than anyone and will notice potentially problematic changes first. Here's a list of the main things that can help increase a cat's life. A nutritious and balanced diet, a healthy weight, spaying and neutering, regular vet checkups, regular exercise, and keeping your cat mentally happy with quality time together, interactive toys, etc. It's not good to dwell on the death of our happy favorite, but there are things we can learn to provide our cats with the longest, happiest, and healthiest life possible. Much less research than I expected has been done in the area of how long cats live. However, the work that has been done shows that the average life expectancy of cats is increasing. Thanks to medical advances, every day we learn more about how to keep our cats healthy and we are sure of the importance that the responsible doctor has in the expectation of a good one. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for your attention and see you in the next video.